So here you can see that here problem based learning in, in this uh, uh, in this uh, link and uh, all these files here are two models. The first one is the uh, uh, this one is the PV model and grid control PV and this is wind model and uh, this is wind model okay. So uh, what you will do this is PV model and this is wind model both you will run. First of all for example we want to run the PV model the reports are already available for example for for this model uh, this report is available in Word and PDF. This all report how to make uh, this model uh, one by one step by step but this is already because this is already uh, completed you will just run and simulate and get the results and this in this Word file uh, which is already available and you will change the results accordingly you will change your model uh, I will show you like this and uh, you will change uh, different parameters and these pictures you will change and uh, you will create your own report and you will submit it. So here for example uh, similarly for PV uh, this is wind and similarly for uh, PV PV is this this model we will run and the same report is available in Word and uh, uh, in Word and PDF and you will change the result accordingly by your own and you will submit. So first of all let's start with the wind model for example. This is problem based learning part 2. If uh, you will not find part 1 for example which is was uh, about uh, the previous renewable energy simulation if uh, uh, that will not run you will complete all parts part 2 and uh, probably I will upload part 3 also so you will add all parts and uh, which part is not running for example so you will ensure that uh, that part is not running uh, and then you will not submit that report and uh, all those parts which are available uh, for simulation you will run those parts and you will submit so first of all this limity this wind 12 kilowatt wind for example here you can see 12 uh, kilowatt wind this is wind and it is connected to grid. This is grid just for a simple supply 25 uh, voltage, 25k voltage and 50 hertz frequency. This is just a AC source which is connected in between this transformer and you can see this is the wind. And the speed you can change the wind speed also and you will just run for example I will run this model and you will see the results that uh, no you can see the different results for example here you can see the wind speed from 8 to 12 it is changed because you can see in the model uh, that uh, it is changed from uh, 8 to 12 uh, uh, at this time for example this time step is given so at this time step 8 to 12 at step 5 it is changed okay so at step 5 you can see uh, it is changed uh, and uh, similarly uh, the results cube per unit tor t p uh, wr uh, uh, and uh, pitch angle different uh, values are given here so you can also print these results uh, uh, in the files you can uh, print this result and you can paste it in uh, your report so uh, uh, now you will change the models parameters for the nominal power is 12 kilowatt this wind is 12 kilowatt you will change this uh, 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 wind uh, for example if, if your roll number is uh, uh, 123 so you will uh, uh, inject 123 kilowatt wind okay so the line voltage is okay 50 hertz frequency is okay only you will change uh, uh, this 12 will be your roll number for example uh, you have 24 roll number one roll number one kilowatt two roll number two kilowatt this is five uh, roll number registration number five five kilowatt okay so you will change this parameter only and stator and rotor parameter no need to change and then it's okay so turbine here you can see nominal wind mechanical output is 12 okay similarly this is 12 and you will also change here according to, to your registration number okay so you will change this one also and uh, the wind speed is 12 and uh, this speed you will uh, change uh, different for example it is 12 and uh, you can yeah, put it uh, uh, eight, 10 for example so 1 2 or 3 uh, uh, different speeds you can test this model okay and pitch angle control is okay and uh, you can also if you uh, run uh, kp K, ki what's the impact of kp and ki if you will change kp for example 5 10 what was the impact and ki this is the uh, proportional integral and this is the uh, proportional controller and integral pid you can see proportional integral and derivative so here it is used only pi uh, proportional and integral so you will change and you will see the impact of this what what happened and similarly maximum pitch angle 45 and maximum rate of change of pitch angle is this so you can see the uh, uh, different parameters and now you can change the results you can see different at uh, different speeds what is the turbine output mechanical power uh, in per unit 
and turbine speed when uh, turbine speed is changing so at per unit you will see the maximum power as this part so you can take this graph as well also and uh, you can change the different parameters and then you can again run the simulation and the results you will uh, print uh, in the report these results uh, and similarly here yeah, let's uh, run the other model this one uh, this is 12 kilowatt uh, solar system uh, and you can see here and uh, you can see here that uh, 12 kilowatt grid connected system and before uh, simulating this uh, model you have to write uh, this one this uh, in this command you have to write uh, in uh, copy and just uh, in the MATLAB you will just hit paste it here and you will run it and you will see after running this model again will be open and this model you will run otherwise it will not run for example i will run this model before it will not run it will show the error this like this error okay so it will not run so so now you will run this model and uh, when you will run no it's okay it will run it and you will see yeah, it will show results in the end now let's take time 60 percent and uh, you will see after some time so this is 100 kilowatt pv system 330 uh, watt panel and you can see the number of series n and parallel is 66 parallel modules and 5 series and uh, this model is used so here you can see you will run on uh, uh, you will see the results here no this is the pv system so how you will run this this is grid grid connected this is grid and this is converter and this is the control of this converter and this is dc dc and dc to ac and this is inverter and then there is a grid so here you can see pv you we have to focus this pv you see uh, parallel strings are 66 and you can see here series is uh, this one and these are the series strings and this model is used so you can change the models also uh, this is 305 and 305 watt module so also on the panel is 305 watt and you can see the cells per module is 96 shards of current and open circuit voltage you can see here they, and these are the available and uh, you can plot also plot the graph for example here you can see different angles and uh, the current and voltage graph you can see and uh, uh, voltage and power graph you can see at uh, higher temperature the power is reduced so in this way you can see and these graph, uh, graphs you can print and uh, 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 you can see for this single module five series module and 66 parallel strings this is the add uh, for the parallel you will see the uh, current will multiply and five series voltage will be uh, increased and uh, now you can see here if you will change this for example 66 you will change it one and this is one for example so what will happen you can see for one here only uh, 60 watt for example for 50 degrees centigrade say so one series and one parallel so here current is also about 6 ampere so if you will uh, change this to so current will be doubled but Higher here 6 and 12. 12 current is doubled but voltage is same. But if you will change the voltage for example 3 times, so voltage will be 3 times. For example, that was 60 and uh, 180. For example, so voltage is changed. You can see voltage is changed, but current remains the same. So th this co different combination you can uh, write in the uh, report and uh, uh, you can uh, take different parameters and uh, plot. Uh, also, you can change the temperature for example 25. You can uh, Put it here you can see the uh, temperature in Texla the variation of temperature in Texla and uh, you can uh, you, our university so you can change accordingly okay maximum temperature and minimum temperature accordingly you will just say and then you will plot this 20 40 uh, different uh, temperatures in the uh, graphs will be here okay so in this way you can different strings and strings how many uh, parallel strings and series string you will take and you will uh, again uh, uh, your roll number for example your roll number is uh, 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 these two will be related to your roll number. For example, series, uh, if your roll number is uh, 12, so you can take, uh, uh, you can take, for example, half, uh, uh, if it is 12, just divide it uh, into, for example, you can see here, it was uh, 5, and this was 66. Or it is, you can say, 13 times, for example, 13 times. So again, you can uh, uh, put it roll number here, for example, your roll number is, Level one two, so it's and 
and 13 divided by 13 you will get uh, uh, yours uh, if it will be in the decimal you will just uh, take the round of figure okay uh, if it is 12.5 you will take it 30 like that so uh, the euro number here and divide it uh, to 13 here for example uh, your number is uh, very small for example uh, the roll number is a very little uh, smaller number for example 5 so how you will do it so you can uh, take it 5 it here 5 it here for example and you can multiply 13 with 13 and you can put it here for example your roll number is less than 10 9 so you just multiply this with 13 you will take this figure and uh, round off this figure get the round of figure and then you can just take these results okay so in this way this this parallel strings um, uh, it will be related to your roll number uh, in this way you will get these results and you will uh, simulate the uh, results and you will see here uh, different parameters you can take and here again this is the radiance so that is the temperature and uh, different temperature under now you will uh, physically if you want to change the uh, temperature and uh, radiance because the radiance will be different yeah, it is thousand radiance and uh, you can change this uh, radiance as well so here for example click it here this radiance you can say at one second uh, at this point it is changed from thousand to 200 so in this way you can see you can also change it for example in this way and uh, you can change like this so this uh, this value you will also change okay and the temperature you can change also like that and uh, you can take the different values and different temperatures and uh, then you will run your model and these temperature and radius different and uh, also uh, uh, this uh, uh, parameters you will change and you will take the results and uh, you will submit okay and uh, different uh, uh, for example you want to uh, check the uh, output power so this is the output power you can see a uh, different uh, uh, 100 kilowatt and you can see had radius is less so the power is less and in this way you can take these results and also voltage and current for example you can see here so these are the voltage and currents and you can also take okay so in this way you can uh, take the results and uh, similarly for example voltage and current voltage this is voltage and current and uh, similarly you can see here that uh, uh, and uh, here irradiance and uh, the graph of radiance and uh, temperature and these different graphs you can also take here duty cycle we mean we mean like that so these are the different graphs you can also take and uh, you can print it and you can paste in the a report so i think so this is the end of uh, main details if you will perform more variations and more deep analysis you will do you will get the extra credit so this is second part you will run this it, it's run it successfully i will upload these uh, uh, all things in one drive and uh, i will share it with you link and you will download all this uh, data in uh, in this format